G'day guys, Viv here again. I hope you're all keeping well. I thought I'd show you a real quick update of the buildings that I was uh, showing the house paint through an airbrush in the Herstarts buildings with the, uh, the timber moulds and uh, a couple of other things that I'm doing here in the workshop at the moment and uh, the completed dystopian table with all the islands done and uh, some little flo not floating rocks but sort of let, uh, bugger it, let's just go have a look. So here we are in the incredibly messy workshop with those buildings done or well, the roofs on them. You can see the Herstarts moulds come up really well. These have been dry brushed in three layers and the clients use two different types of bricks here um, for building the buildings. Pretty sure they're the Egyptian blocks, one of the Egyptian blocks, the smooth blocks. They've got some little cracks and details and stuff in them and uh, these are the normal, uh, the normal bricks from one of the castle moulds. So they're the two buildings almost done. I've just got to uh, detail up the doors um, and then those buildings will be done. What else have we got here? They also supplied to me uh, these little uh, stashes with crates and buckets and little sacks and stuff. And So they're sort of part way done. Um, these three pieces here, this one, this one, and this one are all Herstarts models. But these ones I'm pretty sure are by a Brisbane guy who used to trade on eBay a while back under the name White Knight Studios, but I haven't seen him around for a long time. And then a couple of little collections of discarded wood, a couple of balsa wood buildings and some small little towers. These are almost finished with their dry brushings. Then I do a little bit of weathering on the top up here and finish off the bases, etc. So that's the uh, the client's job. Well, they had some other buildings or well structures. Again, fieldstone moulds from her starts. Just uh, I've got to put a final dry brush on these. Well, a light grey, maybe a little bit of white. But they're nice and simple. Come up well. Um, so there's those things going on and the dystopian table over here in the background finished all of these pieces here are removable based on some uh, uh, what's this stuff called uh, clear plastic just to give us some small little pieces to be able to move around wherever we want them to be etc so I think the tables come up well little aerial view the little forests are awesome they've come up really well we threw some uh, glass coat into the little pools of water the rivers etc so that's what's going on doing a little bit of casting over here on the casting bench some of our moulds that uh, we cast our bases in is one of our bases sitting up here a uh, sort of a junk pile cogs and sort of I don't know, steampunk sort of moulded, moulding. I've recently started adding dyes to the mould so they come out in grey like everybody likes. And uh, casting up some Herstarts pieces. Barrels and boxes and crates and sacks and all that sort of stuff. So that's keeping me busy. So I'm having fun out here in the workshop. Um, it's, uh, I don't know, 10.30pm or so. I'm about finished for the night. I might potter around and do a few more things before I go upstairs to my uh, little unit upstairs and play some Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. So until then guys, take care and I'll catch you in the next one. Ciao!